Uh, oh, no, no! He's doing fucking Fortnite shit on me! I can't! It's disgusting! Alright, so this is <laughs> Street Massacre playing a bunch of Steam beat em ups today. <laughs> So I can take Screaming Chick or Screaming Chick. Let's take Screaming Chick, shall we? Ooh la. This is all four distinct levels. So yeah, as you can see, these are indeed Steam exclusive beat-em-ups. Oh, Jesus. Okay, whoa, whoa. Oh. So, oh yeah, my, so let me hold on. Okay, yeah, my uh, controller was not... Even though I have it plugged in, um, it was not working. So, uh, keyboard for me, I guess. Okay. Yep. Knife. Good. That's the that's thing. It's a beat em up thing. Okay. Screaming chick, Ula. She's she's got a job to do, and it's and it's doing a street massacre. Okay. We have a block. Interesting. Didn't actually expect that. Do we have anything else? Anything else? Do we have a mega crush? No. Cool. That's great. We have a dash. So, so not a special move like a screen clear or, oh yeah, I want to beat up that guy. That's, that's, he, he should get beaten up. Oh, a stomp. Huh. So, so you don't have a, a mega crush move, but you have a stomp and a dash. That's, that's, that's a choice. Uh, stomps are rare. I like stomps and beat em ups. I wish that's, that was one of those things um, we could have put implemented into the takeover. But there was a, there was zero time. Guns too? It is comically large. It's like Robocop's gun. All of the weapons. I, I look like I'm a tiny person. I look like I'm a child holding this gigantic butcher's knife. A little much. David and Daniel, though, we're fading out. No boss, but that's okay. We don't need them. Whoa! That was instant! That was just fading in from the level load! That'll keep you on your toes. Stomp actually affects multiple enemies on the ground. That's cool. It, it is... I, I'm assuming this game is not finished. Uh, I, I, I did not take a look at exactly... Um, all of the, the details of each of these games. Pretty sure this one is clearly not. It lets you select uh, four levels right from the start. That That's a telltale sign that maybe the game isn't quite done. I still can't believe I don't have like some type of special move. You, you'd, you'd still kind of always want that, even if you're, you're just starting off. Okay, so each gun has only three bullets in. Man, this town is stingy. I, I mean, every it, each shot is a one-shot kill, so this really is a street massacre. Ooh, banana! And the oil drum. Maybe just have a regular drum. It doesn't have to be the one that's on that's on fire, and it has a has a nice clean banana in it. That's it again, huh? Wow, we're playing fast and loose. Look at the size of those traffic cones over there. They're ginormous. Ooh, banana. <laughs> And the, sa the same track over and over. Again, uh, you know, get, get some rando tracks uh, from Steam libraries. Not Steam libraries, but like sound libraries. You can get plenty of royalties free stuff if you just need a temp soundtrack. That's totally fine. That's how that's how the takeover started with a temp soundtrack. Um, that was that was al always there temporarily. Um, and then, you know, I asked Little V Mills and Richie Branson and tons of others to make some pretty cool music for it and just, you know, but, but you maybe not want to have the same track on every stage, just, just saying. You know, honestly, with how colorful this is and, and one or two moves I'm surprised about, dashes and stuff, this, this certainly has a, a, a lot of work left to go. But I'm at, damn it. I'm actually kind of surprised. Like, there, there's something salvageable here. Oh my god, why can't I... Every time I was trying to punch. That's why you need a Mega Crush, folks. That's why you need some type of get off me special move. Oh Jesus. How am I going to do this? There's so many. There's so, I am dead. 
And that's an instant game over, I guess. Oh, press key to continue, but it brings you right to the main menu. Um, let's try training mode. I'm surprised. It's cool that it's in there. Hell, uh, Streets of Rage 4 didn't even ship with the, the training mode. So that's something. I don't think there's enough moves to really train, but... Um, yeah, this was this this was exactly what it advertised on the tin. It said Street Masker, and it was indeed a masker on the streets. Um, yeah, not not the worst thing in the world. I have played worse, but uh, I have a couple of Steam beat 'em ups I wanted to to beat up today. So why don't we move on to the next one? All right, so this one is Red Nose. Red, that's a cute name. War Dogs. That's less cute, but Red Nose, very cute name. So I think if you are of the certain uh, fans of certain things, you might like this one. All right, here we go. We're at the Wawa's. <laughs> Still looks too clean and neat for a dive bar. Sorry for keeping the place somewhat presentable. Hello. I knew you'd show up sooner or later, Red. Oh, really? And why is that, Cindy? Is it because you know how much I like the ambiance here? Uh, just pour one back, cause you always find come find me when you screw up. Whoa! Hey, who owns this dumb? This turd belongs to the slaughter club. It just about out of booze. Whoa, this one will do it. You done mind it? I'm right, bro. <laughs> Hell yeah, we're gonna wreck this town all night. These seem like nice lads. Sorry, Cindy. Gonna have to leave until later. Me and the bros! Gonna chat outside! Amazing! Okay, if you're gonna make a mess at a bar, at least pay for your drinks, assholes. That's, I mean, I, it'd be better if they didn't. Look at him, this good boy. He's barking mad. Whoa! Okay, alrighty, I see it's one of these beat-em-ups. That has cooldowns on, on your special moves. Which is... Not inherently a bad thing, but it's not my favorite, though. Damn. Whoa! I don't know what the hell that was. Numbers going up, big bar filling there. That makes me feel... It's like... A Mortal Kombat 9 Super Bar. Where each, each one that goes up, you get a different buff. We'll see what that does. Oh, there you go. B, 50% damage increase. You know, graphically, the, the animation's a little stilted, but this isn't... This is actually pretty solid, visually, overall. You, you, move, you move a little too fast, maybe. There's, there's a certain quickness where, where it's, it's kind of hard to feel what you're doing. No weapons as of yet. Oh, jeez, okay. Okay, maybe, maybe too much. Maybe too much in the slowdown. Hey, he comes down with a slam. I was like that type of stuff. But I don't know. Maybe he should come running in. Like, you know those dogs that like run into the giant piles of leaves? And they just go nuts. Maybe he should do that. Like, he just he just knocks all these dudes over. Okay, that's it. Nope. Oh, there's, a, there's another big dude. So many big boys. There's Okay, there's a third one. They are kind of the damage sponges so far. Ah. Uh, oh. Ah. Uh, Okay, I hit him? Wait, no, he's okay. Stay down! Play dead! Alrighty, I'm liking the feel of this place. A bit, a bit grungier. Hmm, little dark though. I don't, this is kind of trying to do that silhouette thing. That like, what, Double Dragon Neon, Donkey Kong Country Returns, that type of stuff. What the? Those guys are cool! New, new reminds me of Fudoki here. I can't tell quite what these are because the camera's pulled far back, but they look like foxes. Uh, reminds me of the super hot uh, fox ninja girl from Ninja, Tur ninja Turtle Comics, the Archie ones. I, I think her name was like Ninja something, nin Ninjara, something like that. But she should have been in the in the cartoon. Maybe she was in the cartoon. I didn't see all of. I didn't see. I didn't see the majority of the CGI TMNT cartoon. And I never finished Rise of TMNT, so maybe she's in there. But I'd like to think if she was, people would have informed me. Okay? Yep. 
What? Oh, sure. So fresh and so clean. Yeah, uh, this is a good track so far, too. And, like, I always like, you know, not enough rooftop stages and beat em ups. There's a couple here and there interspersed throughout. Uh, Team NT Shredder's Revenge had a, had a good one, too. Tie rooftop stage. But yeah, it should be used more. I would, I would have a whole, like, like, martial arts, like, Japanese infused furry beat em up game. Like, this, like, Metro City stuff, it's fine, it works, whatever. Kind of like, uh, kind of like, oh god, uh, but not Bonsai Warriors. Uh, Jiu Jitsu Squad, which I played on the channel a couple of months ago. More of that, please. And I'm pretty generous with health so far. I also have a, a health buff I, I can use if, if needed, but... This full level 3, I'll take that. Now what? Hello? Whoa! Wasn't expecting that! Oh! Cool. W weird, but cool. Kind of liking the vibe. Jeez. Guy... Uh, Guy Jiru? He's pretty cool. Is, is this an actual boss? I feel like it is. Oh, damn. Okay, yeah. Don't try to avoid hitting him when he goes into that stance. Fair enough. Oh, shit. Shadow clones. Neat. Kind of don't understand how they work yet, but that's okay. I don't know if he's got two swords. I'm not going to be able to top that. Very nervous. Huh? I do have two more lives, so I'm pretty sure I can tank this out. Remember, kids, you can just tank out most things in life. All right, stage complete. I think... I, I think that's that's a good... So what is this? So, sorry? These loot boxes? They're loot boxes! I don't... N no? Yes? How are we on this? 50-50? As long as I don't have to pay for them. Maybe it's like a roguelike uh, loot box system. That's... Mm. But yeah, that's, that's War Dogs. It's... Um, but yeah, no, there, there's definitely some potential there. The the, the fighting does uh, have a little less impact than I would like, but I'd certainly keep following this to see if it progresses. I'm not sure if it's 100% done, but uh, yeah, let me know what you thought in the comments. All right, Sword of the Guardian. I think this is supposed to be sort of like a and d like in the sense that it's modeled after Capcom's D&D games, I think. Monk. Swordsman, Dwarf, Monk. <laughs> I'll take Butsu. He's, you know, like, like Guts. No, Butts. His name is Butts. If something stinks, it's usually him. Okay, stage one. Beginning. Uh, finally, I am here. It should take me a few more hours to reach Dak Wolf. Dank Wolf, more like. Can't believe that they are in this remote place. Guess they are not here for us. It's not bad art. Uh, yes, I think you are right. Their soldiers are nearby. Tut! How unsurprising, and they seem to have noticed us. As usual, we will kill all passers by so nobody will know. That's why we have paid so much effort to be here. But before we pass by, let's see if we can get some intelligence. Sorry, we are visitors. We want to visit the relatives. When you are dead, you can ask those in hell. Said guy with no eyes. Wait, do you mean you need to kill us? <laughs> okay. Let's move. Excuse us. That's a great, cool saying to, to shout right before you fight. Excuse us. All right, that bun does that. Nice to know. Is there already juggles? <gasps> Ooh. Hey, listen. The localization is not great. Uh, graphically and animation-wise, this isn't great, but I'm already feeling it. There's something here to the combat. Give me a second. Yeah? Yeah? Yes? Okay. He already does play a little bit like the warrior in, in Shadow Over Mastara or, or whatever. Capcom's D&D games. Okay, okay. Whoa! Hey! Hey, yo! Little, little fast there. 
Okay. Let's calm it down. Cool. That kind of juggles or but axe. Ow, ow, ow. Hold on, hold on. H ow! All these guys just look like the, the knights from Monty Python. So all these guys are just like, I'm slashing them all up and they're just like, it's a flesh wound. Clearly isn't. Throw multiple knights. Oh my God. It's like a, it's like a Castlevania axe. Oh, oh, yo, yo, we, there's some sauce. What did I just, you Kemi? What was that? Yo, Sword of the Guardian, what's up? I've had this in my Steam library forever. I was just, I just saw the screenshots. I was like, yeah, it looks like a thing. And this is the first, this is the first, like, when I say a long time, I mean like five years or some shit. Ooh, that's, those aren't bad environmental effects, I do have to say. We have, we have a Molotov. What did, what did that look like? Oh my God, I got hit out of it. Can we see that again, please? Ah, uh, I think I used it all. Wait, bomb? Whoa, that's the screenshot I saw on the Steam page. Had this huge fireball and I was just like, that looks cool. It doesn't take a lot to impress me. Whoa. This shit, wait, what? Man, you really know your stuff. In the name of God, you dare not move an inch further from now on. All right, whatever you say. Holy assassin, what brings you here? Holy assassin, what are they? Holy Assassin is the largest assassin group recognized by the state church. They assassinate officials of heathen groups. You mean the ninja looking dude is a holy assassin? Your religion is intriguing. You can control life and death matters. Dudes, <laughs> aren't you afraid of hell? Is that him? Where's the other guy? This is weird boss music. Do they both take damage? I guess. There's wall splats in this too? Damn. Yeah, this is wild, man. Even though I, I, I got this game, like I said, years ago, because I thought it looked okay, I didn't actually think it would be okay. That's not why you have Steam. <laughs> you, <know? laughs> you have Steam, so you can get things for like one buck. That's that's what it's going make, to make YouTube montage videos with this stuff. Yo, oh, 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 fuck yeah, damn, what the hell are you? This chap has never seen a real devil. Sigh, it's better for me to go and chant. <laughs> ha, ha, do you step on a Lego? Don't worry, you're still alive with an intact body, but who knows what will happen next. We just follow orders, please spare me. Spare you? Did you spare those you killed? I am so sorry. Please spare my life, please. Hey, I'm going ask that infidel. Hey, Baldy. Enough. I have a bad hunch. Let's get going. Yes, their behavior is becoming absurd. I think everyone's behavior is pretty absurd here. Um, tut. Okie dokie. Let's head towards the village. This is crazy, man. Curve village. Oh, that water. Why do we take this way? You know I'm short. It's hard to move. Hang in there. We'll be there soon. Oh, breathing. That's the key. Breathe. That's fine. Archer, it's, it's a flesh wound. This archer's... What the shit is that? All right, this is starting to hurt my eyes. Sort of the guardian. I don't know. Oh, that flash is rough on the water. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, let's hit a few more buttons. I might quit out. I, I don't know. This might be something I return to later in a bigger video. Yeah, let's let's quit to uh, title here. Because I can only take so much in one go. Um, but yeah, Sword of the Guardian, it's on Steam right now. And and it, this might be the best one we play today. I, we do have one more game, so I'll see. But but I'm, I'm actually kind of digging this. I'll be a Guardian of the Sword. Why not? All right, so this is Brawler. Um, that's that's a straightforward title. <laughs> Beat him up. Whoa, look at this. That's actually pretty hype, though. I'm, I'm, I'm liking the vibe. Hawk. 
Wow, it's like Hawk from like um, Fighting Force. And, and now the next character, please. Blaster! Blaster McMassive. The ladies. Taylor Swift. No, the lace. Wait, Hawk, Blaster, and lace? Like Hawk, Smasher, and Mace? And then Kira! Okay. Whoa, look at this lineup of supermodels. <laughs> we have Kira. If you ever want to see her again, come and get her. Okay, so I guess we don't get to select. <laughs> I love the honesty. I love it. Okay. So so the developer is called Cobra Blade. I'm all about that shit. Good stuff. All right. So yeah, we got Hawk. We got Taylor Swift and Blaster. Uh, maybe Taylor Swift. She's the problem, it's her. I can't wait to play this. Uh, okay, no, it's fine. Oh, this reminds me of Xbox 360 indie games, though. <laughs> oh. Yep, it's called, this game is called Brawler. It is exactly what it advertises. I was saying, I was saying that the, God, the first game, Street Massacre, it was what it says on the 10. This is this is the whole glacier. Mi oh, oh, frosty balls. Weird. What's those weird silhouettes in the window? That's creepy. So, so, so yeah, Cobra Blade, God bless you uh, and everything that you do. Why did gold have the same picture as Spike? It, that was that was that was odd. But yeah, Cobra Blade, you're doing it. You absolutely have made a brawler. That is what we are doing right now. With our fists and or feet. And knees too. So I also can't really seem to find a special move. I'm pressing what I think I should just be pressing. Uh, a punch and, and, and attack or attack and jump together. Nothing yet. God, that's a rusty ass barrel. Burger. Why does Burger got a man's face? Why? I I don't know. I think this game might be completed. It's one of those where I'm, I'm not 100% sure, but I'm, I love these character names, though. I feel like they're looking into my my brain for these character names. Little little funky. That's okay. That's okay. Ow. Okay, we is Rhino. He's got to go go. You can't stay around here no more. More. Oh, you can actually hit guys while they're while they're on the ground too. This is weird. Both this and Street Massacre. Okay. Music looping. And, and there was a... That was a disc... Time? You can get... You can put more time on the clock. Why? Look how slow the time counts. 69. Nice. It's like five seconds every second. Is time that much of an issue? I don't... I don't think it would be. Whatever. Okay. Sure, crate. I think it's probably just using the last portrait of whoever you fought. So there it was like, uh, whatever, Rhino. So the next time I hit that crate, it was Rhino's face. So definite bug there. And I'm just realizing, isn't the guy I just killed uh, Frosty Balls, the dude in the blue, isn't that just Hawk's character model? Sprite, whatever you want to call it. All right, we're moving on to Lip Skill Burgers. I don't know. I don't know if it's supposed to mean anything. So I believe we're in a mall, but it's the foggiest mall ever. With with the dry ice on the ground? Like, are we in Silent Hill 3? What's going on? Uh, uh. Go. Oh! Who's the boss? Raven! Yep, that's me. Abaddon! Oh, shit. Raven's, Raven's flock. This is the winter of my discontent. Abaddon has some type of gun? Or a syringe? What is it? Okay, good stuff. You know what? We might have Abaddon just kill me just so we can see what the continue screen looks like. Game over. What? Okay. Can I not input my name? <laughs> Maddie Fat! 
All right, cool, click. That's weird that it's it's done like that. A lot of a lot of this was weird, Cobra Blade. But I got like I'm glad you exist. And with with fusion, I guess. Um, so yeah, that's Brawler. There's. Uh, let's move on to our next game. This is beat down Brawler. It seems. Uh, Trey Generico. I've I feel like I've seen this character model before. Billy, Shadow, Sarah, and Harry. We'll, we'll stick with Generic Ninja. These models look really. Oh no, maybe it doesn't. This is a 3D uh, uh, brawler, as you can uh, plainly see. I guess this is like more of a Sifu style thing. Let's see. Okay, dude, dude. All right. With, with some funky physics, that's fine. Some funky ragdoll. Oh no, my god. These are these fucking asset flipped character models I've seen in like six other games. Like fighting games. There's that really bad uh, fighting game on the Switch, but there's also variants of it on Steam. It's just called Fight. And it had that weird gas mask guy that I just beat up. And this generic orchestral music. Oh my god. But to be fair, I like the cell shading outlines on the characters that helps them at least pop a little. Oh, oh hey, ho, oh, hey, ho. Oh. <laughs> Failing in your task. Let's let's retry. Cares just spawn in, huh? Yeah, there they are. And they just change a few colors. So listen, um, this this is already like seemingly like like a demo like a proof of concept more than anything else that's just going for my overall first impressions but at the same time the fighting works and it's responsive i guess but i don't like wave-based stuff that much y you know i, I want to progress through a level i want to see a level design how about you guys but like uh wave-based stuff is is never I can never hold my attention for for very long because because your combat has to be on point for that to be engaging. And while this certainly isn't bad, it's not uh, it's not exactly inspiring me either. But we'll see. There there are other levels. There's other characters. Just beat up Ray Ripley here. Get out. Get out, mommy. <laughs> what? <laughs> All right. Sure. Yeah, definitely seen this this trick before. A fucking game. There's like three or four games, and I think they they're mostly all fighting games. And I'm not sure if it's the same developer or that made all of them, or they yeah they're just Unity or or whatever uh, models that you can just buy from Steam Workshop or what. Oh, it's Rocksteady. Yeah. There's a gross bear monster in the in these uh, character models, but this rhino is absolutely there. No! Uh oh no no! He's doing fucking Fortnite shit on me! I can't! <laughs> Bitch disgusting! Okay, let's let's try um Sarah. Sure. Map? Ooh, subway, the pits, docks. Oh, there's quite a few. Okay, load in. Load. Oh! Actual traps. But yeah, we're just stuck in this arena. Oh my god, look at the amount of shit that. <laughs> I have been defeated, failing in my task. That should be the new, like, memeable game over screen. You've been defeated, failing in your task. This does hurt. That did kill another enemy right there. There you go. That's fair. That's fair. You can't ask for anything better than that. If the giant wrecking ball kills both. <laughs> well, we're playing Mad World, not Mad. Yeah, Mad World. I was supposed to see Anarchy Reigns, but I guess it's both. What was that? Why would I get temporarily electric shocked? So yeah, I seem to have a different fighting style over the ninja. I'm, I'm, I'm mostly punches. I'm a punch-based character. That's fine. 
That works for me. And 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 a few kicks randomly too. Okay, get in there. Oh, look at this luchador. Mass muscle. Whoa, look at that pose. I feel the intimidation wafting off of him. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's see how far we can get. You know, I said it's wave based, but I don't actually see like a counter for it. So maybe it's just a predetermined amount of enemies, but it doesn't actually tell you. And then we fight like a weird like fat bear in a training gi. I'm assuming so. Clearly strateg strategizing. Stop taunting me. Maybe that's affecting my stats or some shit. <laughs> Neat. Ugh. Well, at least my assassins got what was coming to them. Yeah, that's enough of beatdown brawler. I think I think I get it. Um, there there's something there. I don't know what it is, but um, always nice to play something a bit more three dimensional. Um, yeah, I, I could see this being reworked in, into maybe something with a bit more potential. But uh, yeah, maybe, maybe lose those character models. Oh my god, I've seen them so much. All right, so we're yep. We're finishing up with, yes, this, Maiden Cops. That logo looks vaguely familiar. Yep, this, this, is, <laughs> this is what we're doing. Uh, to be honest, the screenshots of this look pretty solid. This is just a demo of the game, though. So, yeah, okay, it's not super finished. She's cool. Didn't even get a, a selection of the characters there, so I think she's the default one. What do I got? Okay. Dash, okay. Big, big flying peach. That's fine, too. That's pretty punchy sound effects. I do have to say so. I'm seeing uh, special move buttons on the top. So it's another cooldown game, I think. I'm getting cooldowns. You know, I'm fine with them. Uh, it's not my favorite for, for a beat-em-up because it's... I don't know, kind of less strategy almost, but there's ways to design around it. Ooh. So that's what that one does. Inadvertently press that button. Go, go, go. go. Oh, was that Godzilla tail? What's hey? I, it's, I'm into that. That's not bad. Look at that fire in the back. Ah, oh, it's raging in there. That's pretty good. I love how it's like kind of happy-go-lucky characters, but like it's complete chaos. Ooh, ooh, what was that? They grab me? Huh, that's interesting. I can grab out of that or like mash out. Yo, that that's a pretty legit attack. With the blue fire, I guess she is supposed to be like a dragon girl or something in general. It's pretty solid. I didn't think I needed to mention this, but like, yeah, the... Visually, I mean, this is probably the most solid thing we've seen yet. Uh, today, at least, I think. Like, like, some of the animation's a little stiff here and there, or the proportions are maybe just kind of a little off. I'm not sure. But again, this is a demo, so sprites could change a little bit. But the overall animation quality is is pretty nice. All right, let's, let's go inside a Maiden Cops police station. So it's just like Streets of Rage 4 where we walk in and all the cops, but we're the cops! Oh no! We're the we're the maiden cops. I didn't, I didn't actually, even though that's what the game is called, I didn't actually put that together. So that's fine. You know, it is what it is. Oh! Oh no, we got uh we got evasive rolls. But yeah, with with the cooldown special moves, I'm not sure. Cause I can't really do a special move whenever I want if that meter is is depleted. I think it was going up by itself earlier, which is, eh, I don't know. So I hope that's like an option in the final game, whether to select from that or just have button commands or, or you get these moves as you play through the game. You unlock them, you know? I prefer that. Go, go. Stay down! Do uh, This might be one of the, the few games where we don't have a uh, on-the-ground attack. I would like, you know, whenever this game gets completed more, I would like to check out the other characters, just see how... It's like, is there a grappler? Oh, God, I hope. Oh, God, I hope. I think there was a cowgirl somewhere in the in the uh, main title screen. I'd be dead. Yeah, yeah! That's my character! 
So yeah, now we're in the actual prison proper. Don't let them out. They they stay they can stay where they are. They're 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 baddies. They're no good dicks. Yeah, aside from that, this is the demo, but this seems to be kinda it so far. Uh, I'd assume there's probably, maybe hopefully, some other mechanics thrown in there. Like maybe a super ooh, maybe like a giant super or something you can throw all your meter into that or you can like combine all three of your special moves or something yeah because as it stands unless i can play co-op this seems like it's uh, yeah it's player two coming soon i was gonna play in co-op maybe maybe there should be some co-op moves uh like you team up with your friend and actually do some double damage you know and yeah enemy types for this stage um seem to be like there's three there's three variants and that's it which is a little low again demo but just making a note of it. That's a good attack. Oh, it can follow that up. That was an additional input. That's probably their best move. Snabby, snabby. Just doing Cody proud. If Cody was to look into the future and into another dimension and see that there's dragon girls and cowgirls fighting the fights, the final fights, and you just throw a knife like that, Cody would be like, that's damn good stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm still I'm still thinking about 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 the cowgirl, honestly. Where are we going? Oh, gee, bitch, I'm a cow! Bitch, I'm a cow! Uh, but yeah, no, I'll give this a go when the cowgirl's at it. I don't know. I just got I got Wild West cowboy cowgirls and Moo Mesa vibes off her. Man, I haven't seen that show in years. The the real one that not the one I just made up, but the real uh, cowboys and Moo Mesa. Isn't there a game? Act? Isn't there a beat 'em up? Holy shit, should I play that on the channel? Let me know. Get out of here. Get out of here. Everyone, leave. Now I'm thinking about Cowboys and Mubesa way too much. Okay, we got we gotta find a boss or something, cause this is uh this is uh, going on a little long this stage, honestly. Oh well, did did I did I call it boss? No. Never mind. It seemed like it. I that because of the arena. Uh, there's something about it that, that made me feel boss. Oh no, there's Miranda! Wow! That is like one of Poison's alternative costumes in Street Fighter V or something. Reminds me a bit of it. Yeah, it's combine Eddie E and Poison together, you get Miranda. But, but see, they're, they're, they're a corrupt cop, you see. So anytime I hit them like once, they do this gigantic... Uh, jump and there's also dave dave uh, also it just so happens to be another corrupt cop from final fight 3 that does this exact same butt attack i i gotta do some serious damage on miranda here just go away go away don't butt slam me thank god see, see after one no after one single attack they go into this this animation that's a bit much you gotta change that up. Damn it. Miranda, please. Take this. Oh, they still got like a pixel. Oh, fine. We're dragging this out. Fine, fine, fine. Come on. Kill me. Oh, kind of dead. Oh, she's gonna explode. Wait, wait, she's still not dead? Oh, I may have to finish them all with a special move or something. Is that, is that it? Okay, that's it. Yep. Everything was designed to perfect. Jeez, <laughs> throw this character at me again. <laughs> so that's Maiden Cops, and that's our video for beat em ups. Um, th this is pretty solid. Uh, I'll check this out maybe if they, they add a few more things, character stages and all that. Uh, but let me know what you thought in the comments below about Maiden Cops or any of the beat em ups uh, played today. Links in the descriptions on the, for the store pages where you can find these if you are so inclined. And yeah. Baby, beat em ups are back. Like there's there's dozens more of these uh, on Steam, so I, I'd be willing to check them out if you guys are willing to watch me brawl through some more.